Fulcha, everybody. I just wanted to give you a quick quick update on my tomatillos. As you can see, if you remember just a couple weeks ago, they were so small, they were probably down to about here. Uh, they're, they're profuse. They are profuse growers. And, um... You always have to have more than one because they pollinate off each other. They pollinate through the wind and also through um, insects. But I'm loaded up pretty well here so far with some really nice tomatillo uh, flowers. And of course we have a pollinator right there on my lemon balm. I think that's a cabbage moth. But she's um, she's gonna pollinate everything for me. I think it's a cabbage moth because she's over here after my um, after my kale. As you can see, I think she might have left a little a little baby in there that's been eating it up. Oh, she's really coming. <laughs> anyway, back to my tomatillos yeah my plants are actually very very healthy um, I would have them in the south garden because they they do like it the sun but we get enough sun up here about half a day's worth of sun whereas the back is all day but they like it out here they don't fry up they don't um, they don't um, dry out which sometimes could be very bad for a tomatillo and of course with these I like to eat them right off off the, um, the plant I like to eat them right off um, Mario and I will make some salsa verde with it with them of course that's pretty much what you do with them. Yeah, folks, these are just my tomatillos. Um, yeah, so out here in the North Garden, a little cabbage moth, she just won't leave me alone. Um, a lot of the Irish foliage definitely got fried. My, um, my self hill got fried it just fried fried so I just cut this up returned it back in um, so that was definitely fried way before it was supposed to my lemon balm is doing good and a lot of the other things here in the North Garden is doing well uh, my hawthorn the fairy tree definitely had a little bit of, of um, sun damage as you can see but Anyway, we're doing really good, really good. My English oak has, European oak has definitely grown probably about two and a half feet since I've, since the beginning of spring. But anyway, yeah, he's doing really well. I like it. All right, thank you. Just a quick tomatillo video. Bye.